So the tough break update hit, and you've noticed something. Pyro is pretty good, but everyone seems to be running Flog, and maybe you're having trouble dealing with them. Flog received some substantial buffs in the update, most notably the damage falloff changes for flamethrowers and a complete invulnerability when taunting. If you're not very familiar with how to beat them, or you don't think you're very good, what do you do? Switching to Soldier is the easiest way to deal with a Flog Pyro. A Soldier has tools to deal with the Pyro in the close range, and has the ability to handle the Pyro very well in the mid and long range. With the ability to reflect your rockets being gone, the Pyro has a very hard time in the matchup naturally. And when the Pyro uses his charge, the Soldier has a plethora of options to deal with, such as... Keeping a Flog Pyro in the air is one of the best ways to deal with them. When a Flog Pyro is in the air, he can't activate mm or move like he'd want to. If you see a Flog Pyro and you have the option to, shoot his feet and send him flying. If you can, go for the air shot. If not, you can always just try to shoot where he lands to kill him. Speaking of killing him... Mm takes around 225 fire damage to fully charge. While this isn't a lot, it can be rather hard to get for a lot of Flog Pyros. Often, a Flog Pyro will resort to spamming a detonator or scorch shot to build his charge. Try to punish the Pyro for having these out by rushing him and killing him, or at the very least pick up medkits when you're lit on fire by these. Another thing is to be very wary of bunching up as a team, as a Flog Pyro could just rush up and get a free charge off a group of people. Speaking of the charge itself... Don't try to stand your ground against the charge anymore. Instead, retreat off and make it a pain for him to come to you. The moment you hear, you should be wary of your surroundings and where he'd come from if he's going to attack you. You do have to be wary about this against good flog pyros, as they'll often mask their taunts noises by doing things like calling for medic. Do things like plant stickies in between you and him, and don't let him get close without hurting or downright killing him. There are times when you can stand and fight him in the close range, but don't count on it always. Giving up ground is generally worth it, as you can always retake it back after killing him or when he retreats. A Flog Pyro is a scary snowballing threat, but he's also fairly vulnerable and generally slow to start out. By taking active steps against it and respecting the fact that he's basically a speed hacking area of effect heavy when he uses his charge, as well as punishing him and his team for not having air blasts, you too could be well off in this update that seems to be swarming with them.